Zag Infotech service begins here. Welcome to the Zen GST software demonstration developed by Zag Infotech Private Limited. Let's start with the creation of the masters. In order to create the master of the individual, first you need to select the individual master. After clicking, you just need to select the add button. After clicking on the add button, enter the basic details of the individual like name, date of birth, gender, nationality, PAN number, father's name, address details, contact details. In the same manner, you can create the master of other than individual also. Now we will proceed with the creation of the client. In order to create a client, you just need to select the client, click on add button and create the client. The basic information of the client like the status of the firm, like proprietorship, partnership, HUF, private limited company, etc. After entering the name of the organization, PAN number, GLN, SIN number, date of incorporation, enter the details of the address, contact details, the GST of the client. In the same manner, you have to enter the details of the owners, managers, auditors, signatories, and the goods and services provided by the client. This will help you in formation of invoices. Now we will proceed with the creation of the bills. In order to create the bills, select the bills in the menu. First we will see how to make setup of the bills. Click on setup in order to create the setup for the bills. Now. Select the client for which you want to make the setup of the bills. After selecting the client, come on the setup tab. Now, click on the add button in order to make the setup for the invoices, goods and services. Select the information like billing for, discount type, bill number, bill type, supply type, memo type, etc. After entering all the information, click on save button. Now we'll proceed with the creation of invoices. In order to create the invoices, click on invoice sales button. Now select the client for which you want to create the invoice. After selecting, come to the receiver tab. Select the receiver for the client. Now you have the option to make the invoice for the goods as well as services. Let's proceed with the creation of invoice of the goods. Here is a gist of the invoices already created for the client. Let's learn how to create a new invoice. Click on the add button in order to create an invoice. We have given you various options like memo type, bill type, invoice type, invoice date, invoice number, receiver name and various other details. Select all the details in order to proceed for printing the invoice. After entering all the details, click on save button and proceed further. Now I will explain you about the GST returns. Let's learn how to file the GSTR1 return. This is the dashboard or we can call it as a summary of GSTR1. Here you can view all the clients you have created in the software. Let's select SAC Infotech in order to proceed further with GSTR1 filing. Click on Fill Forms. Now you can see the list of all the invoices which are gathered for GSTR1. I am selecting B2B. All the invoices related to B2B have to be entered over here. Click on Add button in order to create an invoice for B2B. Select the receiver name, invoice number, POS that is the place of supply, invoice type. If there is any reverse charge applicability, select the same. And then the taxable value, IGST amount, CGST amount or CES amount. We have also provided you the single mode and multiple mode in order to make an easy mode entry. 
In the same way, we can also fill the information related to B2C large, B2C small, credit debit notes for the registered users. For the credit debit note registered, click on add button and enter the details like receiver name, GSTN number, credit debit note number, note date, reason of note, invoice value, note type, invoice number, etc. After saving the information, you can see that the, all the information will be visible over here on the dashboard. We can create all the invoices like export, advance receipt, advance receipt, adjustment, HSN and other details. For more updates, stay tuned with us. Thank you so much for watching us. Thanks for watching this.